Genes determine our lives. Mutations in genes cause genetic disorders and harm human health. Genome editing technology can change gene sequences, thereby offering opportunity to cure genetic diseases. The CRISPR-Cas9 is a widely used genome editing tool. There are two components to the system, the guide RNA, sgRNA, and a DNA cutting protein, Cas9. The CRISPR-Cas9 technique relies on sgRNA to direct Cas9 to generate double-stranded DNA breaks at target loci. If template DNA is provided, the cleave DNA can be repaired according to the template DNA. This repair is called Homology Directed Repair, or HDR for short. The most ideal and safest way to cure genetic diseases is to precisely repair gene mutations in somatic cells by HDR after birth without endangering germ cells. Precise gene editing has great potential in curing human diseases. However, HDR relies on cell division. After birth, the cell division ability of many tissues is greatly reduced, which causes the inefficiency of HDR. Therefore, cell division ability greatly limits the HDR application in the treatment of genetic diseases. Improving the efficiency of in vivo HDR becomes the key research question to genome editing and treatment of genetic diseases. The research teams from the University of Science and Technology of China and the Institute of Neuroscience of the Chinese Academy of Sciences have made a breakthrough in this regard. They innovated a CRISPR-Cas9-based ms 2 RecA complex protein system. By designing the sgRNA with MS2 binding site, MS2 RecA complex can bind to sgRNA. Thus, RecA protein can recruit more template DNA near the DNA cleavage site and thereby improve the HDR efficiency. This method is called Targeted RecA Enhanced Homology Directed Repair, referred to as TRED. To test the effectiveness of TRED in the treatment of hereditary diseases, the teams applied it to a genetic retinal disease, retinitis pigmentosa. The RD1 mice with a single point mutation in PDE6B gene are a widely used mouse mutant model for retinitis pigmentosa. The visual function of RD1 mice begins to degenerate 8 to 10 days after birth, and they will eventually become completely blind. One group of mice received Cas9 RecA mediated tread treatment. As a control, the other group received conventional CRISPR Cas9 mediated HDR treatment. The results indicated that conventional CRISPR-Cas9-mediated HDR treatment did not produce effective gene repair at all. The gene mutation in RD1 mice treated with TRED was precisely repaired. Wild-type proteins were newly expressed, and photoreceptor cells that were originally degraded in the retina had significant survival rate and restored photosensitivity. More than one month after treatment, the pupils of TRED-treated mice can still exhibit a repaired photoreaction. Furthermore, TRED was used to treat three-day-old RD1 mice, a key stage that the photoreceptor cells in the central region of the mouse retina have lost their dividing ability. The results found that TRED-treated mice can restore certain visual sensitization ability after treatment, breaking the restriction that HDR can only be carried out in dividing cells. These experiments confirmed that TRED technology made a breakthrough in precise gene editing of non-dividing neurons. In future, this technology will likely bring further opportunities to the treatment of more human genetic diseases.